Hey guys, it's me Neon Jacket bringing you another forest guide. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the modern axe. And it's going to be very quick and simple. Okay, that was uh that happened. All right. So now, where I have where I'm starting off, the I obviously didn't have the plane crash here. It is possible that you just crash right over like that way. Um but I did not crash here. I crashed over that way, I believe. And I'm just going to show you from the main village, since it is a very known landmark. As long as you can find the main village and the main cannibal camp, then you should be able to find the cave. Alright. So now, what we're going to do, we're just going to go look on the edge of the camp right over here. You will see a rock and then a giant spike with a cross on top with skulls on the spike. So now what we're going to do is we're just going to journey our way down here into the cave. Now, in this cave, there are a total of three cannibals. I have already gone through the cave and I have cleared them out. So it's just going to be showing you. Now here's the map as well as the compass. And then some more uh, jello punches appearance. Okay, that's wonderful. Now, we're just going to journey down. You just go straight down. There's only one way, and then you'll find this rope. Now, there are three landmarks that we will go by, and I will point out each landmark as we come across them. So we're just going to keep journeying down. Light, thank you. Keep going, keep going. Yeah. Alright. Now, the first land bar landmark, excuse me, it's right here. This wooden wall. I'm gonna go ahead and light just so you guys can see. Now, the first cannibal you should encounter will be right here. Yep, there's his body. It's right here. Now, we're just gonna keep going. We're gonna make a left at where that wood uh, wall was. We're just gonna keep going. You're gonna crouch through there. The second landmark is that skull lantern. We're not going to go down there. That's death. We're going to follow these planks. I'm going to just relight. And then here will be the other two cannibals in this room. Their bodies are just down there. Now, from here, you're going to go until, like, right here where all these corpses are. And then you're going to make a left. And you'll see another hanging skull. Now down here, this is a really long rope, so do not jump down unless you feel confident enough on clipping onto rocks as you jump down. But it is really far down. So if you have a lot of faith in yourself on clipping onto rocks, by all means, go right ahead. But I'm going to take the safe way and go on down. Now once you're down here, there's only one way to go. See a whole bunch of sticks and then apartment and then down here. I'm just gonna go through here into a room full of boxes. This box is, has a whole bunch of helpful things. So loot away. There's a lot of dynamite, some flares, some arrows for the compound bow and all that. Well, not compound bow, but you know. The uh, modern bow. That's what it's called. I've been playing too much. What is it? Um. A game, I can't remember. Uh, but right here is the wonderful and very useful Modern Axe. So that is a quick and easy guide on how to get the Modern Axe. I hope you guys liked it. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I want to know what you guys would like to see as a guide on the forest. So please comment down below on what you would want to see next. Uh, I already have a guide for the katana, so if you want to know how to get that, please go check it out. It's a very quick and simple guide on how to get the katana. And this was a very quick and simple guide on how to get the modern axe. I hope you guys have a great day. And remember, shine bright, neon bright. Bye!